Hey, I'm Colby Keller, porn star, artist, and sex blogger. Get in bed with me. Hey there, hunters. It's me, Colby Keller, your resident sex expert. I promise not to do this again, but I rudely interrupted my guest, Zachary Barnett, for a second time. Uh, but this is our last video of my interview with him. So please, Zachary, tell us more. Right now, in, in phase one trials, I think there's about 15 different components, both preventative and um, therapeutic. Okay. And if people are interested in looking to get more information about all the different trials that are out there, um, there's some great resources on the web. Um, TPAN is a great um, website, tpan.com. Also, um, the Advocates Network, um, AVAC, um, they're incredible. And they, they publish full listings of every single trial that's in in progress right now in human trials um, and they do that uh, annually. So there's some great groups out there that really work on uh, HIV AIDS research knowledge. Um, that's not our specificity. We're just working on one specific thing. We're putting our eggs in one basket. Um, but it's, you know, it's a, that's what makes it exciting. We're taking a specific shot. Right. Yeah. And there's but a lot of promising the stuff out there that's, that people are working on, including this, which is really amazing, I think. And yeah, you know, I think it works. Yeah, you know? I, you know, I keep our fingers crossed and we'll see. Yeah. So uh, that's that's the plan. And how much so you're just starting this first human trial. Yeah. And in terms of time, like what does yeah. that that process look like for you until you really know if it's uh, working or not? So what we're trying to do with this trial, um, the first objective is just safety. You know, we just make sure it's safe. There's no adverse effects. It's not doing anything it's not supposed to do. The second thing we're looking at is we're trying to replicate a study we, we did in monkeys. Um, so we gave the monkeys the vaccine. We see the production of this abzyme. We extract it and then introduced it into five different samples of human tissue that were infected with five different strains of the virus. So um, in those experiments, we saw full neutralization of HIV re replication in about 36, 48 hours. So super effective, very um, uh, effective at both eliminating reproduction, but across every strain. So that's okay. something you really want to see in a vaccine that it's, it's able to work against every strain because you have a lot of mutation within HIV. So you're, you're really getting at a core part of the virus. If we can replicate that example, that study, with antibodies that have been produced in a human, I think that's enough to really blow the lid off this right. and you know quell skepticism and get a lot of support. And at that point, we'd go into a much larger study, um, right. probably international. So are there any strains of HIV that are resistant to this enzyme? Uh, not that we've tested against. We've done the five major strains. Um, and you know we've tested against them. And we think we've been able to attack a core part of the virus that's essential. Uh, for replication, but um, you know we'll have to wait and see uh, when we do the trial. Well, Zachary, thank you so much. It's been very informative. Yeah, you guys need uh, money, not right? Too boring. Uh, for people who want to uh, stay involved and stay in touch, uh, you can find us at endhiv.com. It's very easy to remember. Um, similarly, on Twitter at endhiv. Um, people who want to just like goof around and follow my stupid life on Instagram. Um, I'm at Making Lemonades, and AIDS is spelled like AIDS. Okay. Um, and yeah, you know, it's important to fight for what you want. Um, and I think the most important message here, actually, is it's important to get negative guys on board yeah. with a cure agenda. And it really it's is. not, you know, whatever it is that motivates you, um, if you don't want to be afraid when you get tested, you know, if you want to, you know, have a more open relationship with your positive partner, if you want your friends to feel less stigma, it's, it's you know, it's about removing the the dividing line between the negative and the positive guys. You know, it's got, we've all got to want it. Um, yeah. So I feel like that's there's my two a wall there and we really need to tear that down. Yeah, you know, we're on this boat together and, you know, in the early days, you know, the, the gays really, it, it bonded the whole HIV movement, but then it really bonded LGBT movement, right? right. So I without mean, HIV... The were lesbians that helped gay men, you know, and that... Oh my God, it was like a huge, it was a huge, it was a huge bonding moment for all of us. And then, you know, we really got a little bit more divided um, and now we really need to come back together and say, this is a priority for all of us. Right. Um, so hopefully... Colby, I'm this, I'm counting on you. You got to make that happen. You got to <laughs> well, go shake your tits out I'll there and let everyone know. It's important. Try to do what I can. Yeah, and, you know. And people, can they donate directly to the campaign if they want to? Definitely. We're a five hundred one c three. We're a charity organization. Um, I, you know, I reassure you that I'm not making tons of money here. So you know, you can <laughs> rest rest assured that this is going to research. Um, it's good stuff. 
And uh, yeah, uh, online, uh, we can find us in, uh, in Brooklyn. If you're in Brooklyn, you come visit, visit us in Williamsburg um, and shoot me an email. Awesome. Thank you so much, Zachary. All right. Thanks, Coley. All right, guys. See okay. you next week.